about a vault. I must admit my excitement. I've been curious about them ever since that fateful day. Hold it right there. Vault 81 security. I don't know where you got your hands on a working pit boy, but you better start talking. Vault 81? You're still up and running? Yeah. Pretty good observation there, genius. Now about that pit boy. I got it in Vault 111. Vault 111? Haven't heard of that one yet. And what sort of business are you looking to take care of here in 81? What's with the third degree? It's called protocol. Think we just let anyone in here? Think again. Who is it, Edwards? Ma'am. Some new Commonwealth traveler. Not one of our usual traders. Well, if someone wants in, they can earn it like everyone else. Let me speak to them. Sorry about that. Officer Edwards here was just doing his job. I'm sure you can understand our need for caution. For newcomers, we like to operate on exchange. You help us, we help you. But I'm a fellow vault dweller. Can't you just let me in? Excuse me, ma'am. Before you arrived, he did say he was from Vault 111. And he's in possession of a working pit boy. Is that so? I'm going to allow it. Edwards, open the door and make the announcement. Officer Edwards and I will meet you at the entrance. Come on, Gwen. My guys have been working doubles for weeks now. They need a break. Everyone's working hard right now, Cal. You think I don't know that? Just do the best with what you can. That's all I'm asking. Fine. I'll see what I can do. Absolutely. But you and I both know we Is can't keep going on like this. Necessary? Nice pit boy. If it ever starts acting up on you, see Alexis. She'll fix it right up. Excuse me. Your pit boy ever act up on you? Mine's been glitchy lately. Another outsider? What they let you in for? What's with the attitude? I don't trust outsiders. We didn't need your help before, we don't need it now. The Overseer never should have opened up the vault to your kind. What do you have against outsiders? All outsiders do is take advantage of you. You're nothing but selfish animals. How do you know? Did something happen? Yeah, you could say that. I met a girl from the outside. Said she was going to take me away from all this. I gave her all my money so she could find us a place to live out there. I don't hear from her in months, till a passing trader mentioned she saw her with some man in Diamond City. You outsiders are nothing but liars. Only looking out for yourselves. Sorry about that. Excuse me, where do you think you're going? Excuse me, Overseer. Ready to talk now? We've never encountered a fellow Vault Dweller. Is this Vault 111 you mentioned still operational? Have you ever seen any other Vault Dwellers? You're the first. In all our time here, not a single traveler from another Vault. Here, we pride ourselves on having maintained a successful Vault over these past two centuries. We'd like to be completely self-sufficient. But there are certain resources we can't provide ourselves. Why do you keep yourself so isolated? Why not? We have warm beds, clean clothes, a solid roof over our heads. Our food and water are radiation-free. We don't deal with the elements or raiders. We're safe here. And for some, that safety and stability is what counts. 
Aren't you curious about the Commonwealth and what it has to offer? Of course. But my duty is to these people and keeping them safe. We receive a few select traders often enough to stay well informed. Now, I have work to do. Ma'am, what about his friend here? I'll allow it. Security is already extra mindful as it is. If he's lived this long in the Commonwealth, I'm sure he's chosen his friends wisely. If you need anything else, I'll be in my office. Hey there. So, we got a new visitor today. Don't say anything, but man, I'd love to be out there. If you want to leave, why don't you just go? Wish it was that easy. It's scary leaving the vault. And the Commonwealth? It's all so unpredictable. It's pretty dangerous. You wouldn't last a day. Yeah, that's the fear. At least with the way the Overseer has us working, 81 will still be around for a while. Why the long hours? We're just making sure this roof over our heads doesn't cave in on us. They say it's all the moving parts that have us working around the clock these days. Structurally, I guess 81 is still pretty sound. vault Tech sure knew what they were doing when they set these places up. Well, I don't want to keep you, and I gotta get back to work. Maybe I'll see you around. Hi. We got a barber here if you need it. I, I'm not saying you do. Uh, <clears throat> if you're looking for friendly conversation, you won't find it here. Miranda likes to tell me that I'm just taking 81 for granted, but I can't help but feel trapped here sometimes. Signs of radiation. Impressive. Oh, finally, a spot that doesn't you want a good meeting, see Maria at the cafeteria. She'll hook you up. <clears throat> and watch out for the maintenance. It never ends around here. Hey, Ashes. What are you doing up here? Ashes, where are you going? Ash! Damn it. They're not going to like this. 